Hey guys, my name's Marissa and I'm a fitness coach and stay-at-home mum of five beautiful children. So, here's my morning routine with four kids four years old and under. So, I wake up at whatever time I wake up, usually around then, to this little baby who wakes me up because we do co-sleep and I wake up to him either smacking my face or trying to latch on to my boob because I am breastfeeding and then we have kisses and cuddles and as you can see I also have another child in my bed with me because mum life. Anyways, I set Lucius into his bouncer so that I can get things done by myself and honestly he's happy there he just chills for like an hour then this is my little one-year-old she's the earliest waker after Lucius look at her she's so adorable but I get her out of bed and she just wanders around the house and plays by herself honestly I then get my coffee ready and this is where my morning really starts. I always have a morning coffee. It sets the tone for the day and it kind of signals to me that, you know, it's time to get up and get into the zone. I also always clean up. So as the kettle's boiling, I will just tidy up whatever is there, like put away dishes, wipe down the benches, and then I make my coffee. Here is him getting the kids food while I am drinking my coffee and I will then go into my office to read the Bible as he plays with our gorgeous little kitties here. We still have two more who haven't woken up yet. Anyways, like I said, I go into my office and this is when I do my prayers and Bible time. I didn't actually show you guys my prayer. But I will show you how I study my Bible. So like I said, I say a little prayer first and then I get into my Bible studies. I'm currently reading through Ephesians uh, and the book of Psalms. So this is Psalms. After that, I actually do Bible memory. So I have this app on my phone called Bible memory. That's exactly what it's called. And it's super cool. You basically type in the first letter of each word in a verse that you choose. And over time, you will remember those verses. So this is one that I've been really struggling with, but I will get there in the end. Lucius is fussing now. As you can see, he's crying. So that's about time when I put him back to bed. And then it's time for me to get ready for the day. So, you know, the usual sort of things. I do have a shower. You will notice that I don't brush my teeth. And that is because it's actually the very last thing that I do in my day, you know, after I've done my morning routine. So it might be a bit funny, but I like to finish my coffee because I haven't yet done so at this point of time. So after my shower, I do my skincare routine. Honestly, I'm not very good at remembering it. I either do it at night or if I forget to do it at night, I will do it in the day. And these products are 100% natural. They are from a small business. I think they're down in either Victoria or New South Wales, but they are amazing. And then all I do is put on BB cream. I do my brows, so I fill them in and I do my mascara and that's basically me for the day. Anyways, getting it done. I'll be honest, I don't do this. I probably do this like once to twice a week, but for this video, I thought, why not? You know, I do feel a lot better when I get my face done during the day. And then you'll see me very slowly opening this door because I'm trying not to wake Lucius in his little bassinet there. But I always put my gym clothes on after my shower, just so it's signaling I need to train today. I always feel better when I'm in my workout clothes and it sets the tone for the day. It reminds me that I need to go work out. 
Recently, I've been curling my hair and I did that yesterday. And I only just realized after watching this that I had all these white things in my hair. So let's just pretend they're not there. I don't know where it went. Probably still in my hair, but you know, whatever. Still looks good in my opinion. And now I start cleaning up. So the kids are still in their jammies or whatever they want to sleep with. By now they have absolutely trashed the house. So, believe it or not, this house was actually super clean when we woke up like two hours ago. But because I have children, it gets super messy super quick. So I do a quick tidy up. Here's me making the girls' beds. Usually I do get them. Hi Rayleigh, she's so cute. Usually I do get the kids to help out, but for the sake of this video, I just did it to make everything faster. Then I get the kids dressed and ready. Aurelie's got food all over her mouth, so wipe her down, get her all dressed. And they do choose their clothes. It's so cute. They love their little dresses. And usually, as you will see, we do little jumps. She loves jumping. She just learned that. Then we have Alethea. She's already dressed, but I'm doing her hair. She demands that she has Elsa hair, which is a little braid every single day. Can't stand it, but you know, the girlfriend loves it. They're having a little play. Usually I walk around, you know, have some time with them, just watch what they're doing. And then here's little Amias, being adorable. I'm making my bedroom. I usually make the bed, but of course my boy is just sitting there. I do let the kids do whatever they want in the morning just so that I can get things done. And yes, that includes the Xbox. Then, as I mentioned, the very last thing I do is brush my teeth. And then I'm basically free. We go off to do homeschool after this. And after homeschool, I do go off to the gym. Look how cute he is. I found this little one just, you know, I don't know how that got in his head, but it's cute, so whatever. And I need to introduce you to a little cat, Kit Kat. And that's my morning routine. Before you guys leave, I did want to cover a few things that you may be a bit confused about. One, yes, my kids aren't really involved in my morning routine. I basically let them do whatever they want. They can play with toys. They can go on the Xbox or iPad during the morning time because that time is specifically for me. Like my day just flows so much better. So if you were expecting something like involving the kids, then I'm sorry, but that is how I do it. And honestly, it works really well for our family as well. So if you enjoyed this video and would like to see more, please click the like button and don't forget to subscribe because I will be releasing a new video every single Wednesday from here on out. Bye guys.